Hey kids, as you probably know, this Sunday is Father's Day. And if you want to make your father really happy, we've got a few words of advice for you. First of all, don't get him some lame present like a mug with his name on it or your picture or, or some stupid picture that you drew at school. He doesn't want crap like that. Don't kid yourself. All your daddy really wants for Father's Day is some time alone with your mommy. So get the hell out of the house and let your parents have the kind of fun they used to have before you came along and ruined everything. <laughs> but before you leave the house, do daddy a favor and tell mommy to lay off the sweets for a few days. Maybe, maybe have her run around the yard for a while so she's not so thick around the waist and butt. Daddy's like mommies who don't look so much like mommies, but more like mommy's hot friend, the yoga instructor. Or your babysitter with the big cans, you know, the one going to night school. In fact, get daddy your babysitter's phone number. If mommy's too tired, like she usually is, she could just watch your daddy and the babysitter cuddle. She doesn't... She doesn't have to do anything. That's what she's best at anyway. You know, lying there and doing nothing. Also, let Daddy know if it's Mommy's time of the month. If it is, you can push Father's Day back till next weekend. See, Daddy wants some time with Mommy, but not if she's all bloated and bitchy. <laughs> Just remember, you're the reason that Mommy and Daddy don't get along that well anymore. <laughs> You're also the reason for Daddy's internet porn addiction. Don't get us wrong. Your Daddy loves you. He just doesn't want you around anymore. After all, if he didn't spend so much money on your food and clothes, he could afford to buy Mommy some new boobs. The thing Daddy really wants is his life back. You know, the life that you stole when you came into this world and ruined his and Mommy's relationship. So Father's Day is uh, something you want to make good for your father, go away. Because if your folks end up getting a divorce, it's your fault no matter what they tell you. <laughs> Paid for by the horny, tired, and sick of the kids ruining everything Dads of America.